It is a homeowner's worst nightmare. Giant beetles crawling their way from inside the walls of a brand new home. Six on your side's McKenna King is live in studio tonight with the story of a Treasure Valley family who says they're experiencing exactly that. Travis Stockham purchased his home brand new in May of this year. It wasn't two weeks later when he says the first bug bore out of his wall and that wasn't the end. Now Stockham says he's working with his builder to reach a solution, but each of them have a different solution in mind. I think it was June 6. I had a bug burrow out of my wall. A wall on the second floor of the brand new home Travis moved into in late May. Two to three weeks later, my first floor I had the same thing happened. Large beetles eating their way through his drywall, leaving a round hole about the size of a pencil eraser behind. Bugs usually don't travel in one, so I assume there's a high possibility that other wood's been infected. And at the scary thought that there might be more of these creatures housed inside his walls, Travis called his home builder, local company CBH Homes. I've asked him just to give me an extended warranty on the wood that these bugs are burrowing out of in case I have disclosure issues if I ever want to sell this thing which they have refused. What CBH did offer to do, however, is send an exterminator to the home to evaluate the issue. In a statement from CBH, they say, quote, it was agreed with the homeowner that they would monitor the site weekly. No further evidence of pests or damage has been found since the initial issue. While true, the last burrowing beetle made its appearance over two months ago, a local entomologist suggests this saga might not be over. When these beetles land on a tree or on lumber, they typically lay several up to a dozen or two dozen eggs. It's called a flat faced longhorn beetle and Castrovillo says its typical lifespan starts as an egg, hatches as a small grub, gnaws its way into lumber or whatever wood it's attached to where it then lives for a few years while it matures. Typically within five years or so, all of the beetles that were in the wood are out or they're dead. Which begs the question, would an exterminator be able to eradicate all of the beetles from inside the home? Uh, in most cases, I don't think the exterminator could do anything that could get rid of the bugs because A, you don't know how many bugs are there, where they are, because they're inside the lumber in the house. And if there are more beetles inside Travis's home, they'll work their way out in their own time on the hunt for their next dead tree or pile of fresh lumber. And Castrovillo says they'll likely not cause structural damage. They're not like a termite. Right. And they're not harmful to humans. And they are also are a native bug to Idaho. That poor homeowner yes. to have this potentially for years to right. come because it takes that much time. Right. But what about the possibility of spotting this before when you're framing the house? Totally. Could you look at the wood and know whether or not it's got beetles in it? So it depends. In speaking with the entomologist today, he said that it starts out as an egg and then it turns into a little grub when it hatches and gnaws into the lumber. It would be a tiny microscopic hole and it would be kind of hard to see. You'd have to inspect if it had closely. started to mature, maybe, but it would yeah. be a pretty small hole. So not a good chance that you'd be able to see. Oh, it. all right. Thanks, McKenna, yep. for that story.